I know what you're thinking, what is in the box? Well, actually, if you look through the hole here at the front, what you can see is a scene on the stage, and then this ghostly figure appears and flies off. So how can we do that? Well, inside the box, uh, and if I just take the lid off to show you here, um, what we have is our stage at the back here. And if I just take this part off, uh, we can actually see uh, the figures just on the stage here. But then in front of the stage, we've got a piece of transparent material at 45 degrees. Okay, I'm just gonna put that to one side. And down here, we have my phone, which is actually playing a short video clip that I made. Um, and it's that image on the phone, which is projected onto the screen. Now, this is called Pepper's Ghost. It's been known about for a while, and they used it in the olden days in the theater to have ghostly apparitions kind of appear on stage. And then more recently, they've actually brought people back to life to actually perform on stage. And it's done on this principle. You've got real people on a stage, you've got a screen, maybe glass or plastic at 45 degrees, and this reflects the image from down below the stage. So let's have a look at that in a little bit more detail. So here we have the stage and we've got the various actors on the stage over here. And you should have your audience sat over here. And that means if you've got the audience, and this is just gonna be kind of representing the eyes of the audience, if they're looking this way, they see the actors because light from the actors is reflected from them into the eyes of the audience and they see those people. But what's really clever is if you have maybe people down below here or you have a, an image which is being projected, um, what we can actually do is light from them, it moves up here and then it's reflected off this transparent surface. So light travels from the object below the stage, it hits the screen and then it's reflected into the eye. Now when you're looking through, you can't tell if you're looking at the person on the stage or whoever's beneath it. And that's how we can have these ghost-like things appear. In actual fact, this is the principle behind a teleprompter, also called an auto cue. What they have is they have a reflective screen and this sits in front of the camera. And then this is reflecting words from beneath. And that means that people can actually read a script while also looking into the camera. So this is something that you can try at home. You can just take a picture of an image against a black background. You can actually animate it on PowerPoint and then save it as an MP4. And when you play that on your phone and you just need a small bit of plastic at 45 degrees above it, you can build your stage like this and you can have loads of fun. And when you see the effect, it really is amazing. So that is the illusion of Pepper's Ghost.